Hi everyone, welcome to Conservative Talk with Amy Fan West and uh, Fang Zhang. And thank you, this is episode 10 guys of Conservative Talk and uh -huh. we're very excited to bring more updates on uh, conservative issues. Yeah, we know, we missed <laughs> last week, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, so sorry, you know, <laughs> uh, birthday. my birthday, Your birthday, 40th birthday. <laughs> so, Vegas. yes, we went to Las Vegas. Yeah, I will, I will, I will be there on uh, July 4th. Oh, on four? Trump Tower. Nice. That's yeah. very good. Yeah, uh -huh. we were at the Trump Tower just uh -huh. celebrating. Yeah. But there were riots on his birthday. Mm -hmm. So there was a National Guards mm -hmm. and everyone was there to protect the Trump Tower. Good. <laughs> but, but so far, no one vandalized, mm -hmm. you know, the Trump Tower. But it's just crazy, you know. They they, they can vandalize so something like in Las Vegas. I believe that. Yeah, you know? <laughs> because people are gonna be so strong. mad. Yeah, or the people are strong. Exactly. Uh -huh. So what we got today? So today, this week, as you guys remember, Trump announced that anyone who vandalized the statue will get ten year in prison. That he said a couple of days ago. Yes. And uh, because uh, last, uh, I think it's uh, two days ago, mm -hmm. they tried to tear down the. Uh, the statue of uh, former uh, uh, President Andrew. Yes, right. the formal because they say any statue mm -hmm. that is uh, you know against slavery or any of that they tear down. So mm -hmm. now, any statue they consider racist. But you know after that, mm -hmm. and I believe that uh, Trump developed Trump deployed some uh, of the uh, National Guard. Uh, no, no National Guard. They already there. Yeah. Then he deployed some soldiers there. That's good. Yes, they. Yeah, that's good because mm -hmm. you know there was a they protest. Cannot, they cannot, you in know, Washington. too extreme. It, too extreme. It. Yeah, exactly, and uh -huh. that's too extreme. As America, we understand the peaceful assembly. That's what we have the privilege of in our constitutional right. Mm -hmm. Not riot destroying property. That's mm -hmm. unacceptable. Even common sense, right? If someone goes into your house, last your night city, happened too. Last night happened in Wisconsin, mm -hmm. and you know what? The governor today, mm -hmm. they active. The National Guard. Good, good. In they Wisconsin, just yeah. only Wisconsin. All the state, I believe, they should active the National Guard. Yeah, better. exactly. Special in uh, Seattle, Washington. Yeah, the, because that's their they, job. Yeah, the National Guard. Yeah. They go in and get the job that's done. That's it. They that's got it. a job done. But you know what? They scare because number one, they support mm -hmm, the Black Lives Matter. Yeah, the Black Lives yeah. Matter, and also they they try to you know do something for noisy before the election. I know. It's all about politics, right? Of course. Yeah. You see the uh, Suwon King, right? He mm -hmm. the founder of uh, Black Man Matter. Yeah. yeah. He tried to tear down Jesus Jesus statue. statue. <laughs> see, see now it's no longer about, you know, those uh uh forefather who, you know, have slave, but it's about Jesus, religion now. You know, and it's like, where's our uh, freedom of speech, freedom of religion? Uh -huh. You know, freedom to be an atheist if they wanted to, right? Mm -hmm. But the thing is that the Democrat, the, I call them the extremist leftists, mm -hmm. they have hijacked the Democrat Party and take it so extreme where if you don't align with their philosophy mm -hmm. or their mindset, you're isolated, you're discriminated, you're silent. You know what? Did, did you read the, uh, the uh, demand from the people from Seattle? The they man. have they have 40, uh, 30, 40 men, right? Uh huh. And one of the men, I don't think it's worth. Yeah. They want the compensation for them, mm -hmm. the for the run, papa, whatever for the discrimination in the past, mm -hmm. and they ask for fourteen trillion dollars. It's ridiculous. The thing is that, for example, this this it's 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 a ridiculous uh, philosophy. Okay. Yeah. You cannot pay back like your great great grandfather you know it's like <laughs> what how's that they demand you? that you know they what demand I mean? that yeah if, if you think about in history every mm. ethnicity and, and race <laughs> against each other uh -huh. imagine i say oh the chinese was racist against my great great grandfather and so I, therefore pay me back <laughs> yes that's the way i'm talking about you know what i mean it, it's a ridiculous mindset i believe that work. they make the american people ang angry Oh, yeah. Right now, right now, American people are angry because you know what? They respect the uh, protester peaceful, mm -hmm. but right now they too extreme. Yeah, and I believe that uh, they go too far. Yeah, and exactly. As American, we all agree to have a peaceful protest. Yeah, you know, but mm -hmm. when you go too extreme and destroying things mm -hmm. and killing people, then that's wrong. Everyone knows. Everyone agreed to that, mm -hmm. and everyone agreed to a peaceful protest. 
they're not angry only the protesters they're angry of uh, the media too yeah remember yeah. in Tucson, CNN, Oklahoma yeah we have a big crowd about uh, over 10,000 people in the hall right mm -hmm. and outside of the hall they have about over 10,000 people but mm -hmm. the media the left wing mm -hmm. they took the picture on the top just one guy in the you know empty seat oh my and goodness. they said no one coming oh to the Trump are oh, you talking about the Trump rally yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. I cannot believe it. Yeah. And you know what? We just recently have this uh, uh, talk in the Long Beach politic uh -huh. group because yeah. there are more Democrats there. Mm -hmm. And they're, they're saying, oh, Trump is so bad. He de was defeated. No one came to his rally, so he's so sad. Uh -huh. And I go, this is the face of a man who worked so hard for uh -huh. the American people, right? Uh -huh. And I go, until you work so hard in your life, you understand this face. Yes. But I guess maybe you never did, you know, because the thing is that everyone who look at that face know that's mm -hmm. a hard work, long day work for a man. And also, uh, besides, uh, they uh, vandalize the, the tattoos and something else. Mm -hmm. And what, now, what else we are in this way? So the thing is that, do you guys remember um, this week, uh, the three governor from uh, New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut, uh -huh. of course, Andrew Cuomo, uh -huh. uh, with the other governors, stated that if anyone, with the, this is how they calculate it, uh -huh. within 10,000 people, mm -hmm. if there's 11 cases of COVID, you mm -hmm. have to go back home for 14 days to isolate because those are the hot spot of COVID, okay? okay. But nice. if you don't, mm -hmm. they're going to fine you $2,000. And you know how they're going to do that? If people gonna snitch on them, the mm. neighbors gonna say, "Hey, this guy went on a trip to mm. New York, mm. you know, Connecticut." That's why I know. That's what they gonna do. But see, they that try. Is crazy. They try to. They try. Try to close the economy again. Exactly. And remember the AOC. Mm -hmm. She just talked on yesterday. She yeah. said, uh, "Try to close until November." Yeah. And, Make and sure them lose. Exactly, and this is all political. They want. For sure, mm -hmm. if everyone if everything's closed, they're gonna have to do mail in ballot. Mm -hmm. You see how the cheating is gonna start mm -hmm. throughout the fifty state, and Joe Biden will win. That's the thing. But Trump is not gonna let this happen. The GOP is not gonna let this happen. So they're gonna fight hard. And plus, we need the American people to wake up and say, "Look, guys, mm -hmm. the death toll. I mean, there's there's disease, and you know, throughout the." throughout generation, right? Mm -hmm. And the flu, it kills so much more people in the last year than you know we know. And not only that, I talked to the sheriff of Orange County, just Orange County alone. Mm -hmm. Orange County, right? Yeah, they, yeah they said that uh, the normal death case mm -hmm. a day is about 35 deaths a day, okay? And now how, I mean, count it, calculate, you guys, we have 300 and something days, right? I believe yeah. that they try to do, a, they try to do a politic about the, Mm -hmm. uh, China virus. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. and you know what the other thing is? The Democrats say that's racist to say the China virus. And look at this, what what do we call Chinese food? We call Chinese food, right? Mm -hmm. We uh, Mexican food. We call Mexican food, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. D do do we say that's racist? No. No. It's just normal. Now, what do you normal. want them to call Mexican the Mexican food, food Italian now? food, or Chinese food? What what wrong with that? I know exactly. Now, what what would we propose them to say, say about Chinese food? Do we say noodle food? <laughs> I mean, come on, guys, that's more racist, okay? <laughs> noodle food, come on. <laughs> you, you know, but you know, they try to pressure the social media too much. Yeah. The left wing. Yes. And a couple of days ago, the Twitter, uh -huh. they try to they try to label Tom tweet about the uh, vandalized. Mm -hmm. And he said, if you got a vandalist again and you get 10 years mm -hmm. or In whatever. Uh -huh. and, uh, she said something like that. Mm -hmm. And then he, had, uh, he threatened some, some, somebody else and violation the community guideline. <laughs> and they label him. As? And nobody can retweet it. Nobody can comment. Nobody can like anything on his on tweet. Twitter. Oh on, my on gosh. his tweet on that on that stuff not only you know what See? in in the last I just say last month okay mm -hmm. Twitter would never silent Trump okay just because they know the people will riot right well, because the president right but now since Trump passed you know the censorship for mm -hmm. social media mm -hmm. that Twitter got bold and they're trying to silence Trump, silence people who support Trump, but yeah. not Trump yet. Yeah. Trying to silence the people to stop yeah. liking Trump. That's why Trump tried to uh, uh, try to uh, amend amendment the uh, 
the chapter so called chapter two thirty. Okay. On nineteen ninety six, that protect for the social media. They, they are, you cannot still sue them okay. because they got that protect. Yeah. Now Trump the one to take it out. Yeah. So you can sue them because that's what they're doing. Everybody is, can sue them. Yeah. That's because perfect. Because they they got a protection from yeah. that chapter. Yeah. They so so called the uh, chapter assassin mm -hmm. uh, two thirty mm -hmm. in the laws from nineteen ninety six. Mm -hmm. So that is protect for a social media and a website mm -hmm. or whatever mm -hmm. user, uh, internet provider mm -hmm. they not they not liable for uh, for the you know on the, the platform the mm -hmm. content whatever mm -hmm. you know that's why right now jump one uh, William Barr mm -hmm. he going to take down that one mm -hmm. and everybody can sue them if you feel unfair and policy is unfair mm -hmm. you can sue them mm -hmm. that's they working right now and that's because amazing. of that mm -hmm. you know what the house, mm -hmm. house uh, judge mm -hmm. they invite him to hearing on this week, and he he promised William Barr. That's good. He promised he going to he going to um, uh, testify on uh, July. Uh, I think I believe it's July twenty eighth. Okay. Uh -huh. That's why that's he said. That's okay. And, yeah, that's mm -hmm. perfect because we need to take them down because what they're doing is silence our freedom of speech. I mean that is so vital. As American, you know that we value that. They use that, that policy, and mm -hmm. you know, with the you know, the general language, mm -hmm. you don't know what kind of guy like that mm -hmm. on the Facebook, mm -hmm. YouTube, or Twitter. Mm -hmm. They they using the the guy mm -hmm. but when you read the guy they just use the general language. Yeah. you don't know, so you don't what, know. exactly what is violation or not. Exactly. And if they want to uh, set, shut you down because and, they say it's a violation, and they say you you violation, yeah, right? exactly. Okay, and you don't know. And when you email them, ask them, hey, what kind of violation they got? Yeah, and they they send you the email. They say, okay, look at the guy. Like. Exactly, that's happened to me too during my campaign. I know. What did I do? A lot wrong? of people, a lot of yeah. people got that problem, yeah. and I believe that the two to thirty mm -hmm. have to take it out. Exactly, it's better. And I think right. that will be a ch game changer. But the good news on this morning, mm -hmm. Tom tried to protect the lobster, mm. the, the the fishman oh, lobster, because yeah, yeah. you know they said that and uh, they and they try to stop China as uh, export the lobster to our country mm. and it's very cheap price. Mm -hmm. And right now, Trump today he signed mm -hmm. the executive order mm -hmm. and the memorandum, mm -hmm. and that one the, he he direct uh, he direct to the um, agriculture mm -hmm. uh, minister, mm -hmm. and he said. Hey, you have to protect the uh, laughter fishman. Mm, that's the good. The laughter fishman. Yeah, <laughs> because that's another way of him bringing business back to our fishermen in America here. Yeah, and then so, he stopped the uh, visa mm -hmm. from uh, so-called H1B and H2B. Mm -hmm. They're coming here for work. Yeah, and he stopped it. Yeah, it's perfect. Until the, until and, COVID. And, yeah, and that year. Exactly. And so he tried to protect our job here, mm -hmm. the people in here, and try to cre create the. Uh, uh, business here mm -hmm. and, and the economy, economy okay. to generate. And also in us, uh, I believe it's the, in the Senate. Uh -huh. They propose if you travel on this year, uh -huh. and if you travel inside US, uh -huh. you have to cr you have the credit from tax from uh, four thousand dollar per person wow. to uh, eight thousand for couple. Uh -huh. And if you have kid, you uh -huh. add more, and they credit for you the tax. That's tax good. deductible. Yeah, because that's uh, good. because uh, that if you travel, the economy. because uh, uh -huh. they said that the two of the industry is the very harm uh, damage mm -hmm. from the COVID, the mm -hmm. um, Wuhan uh, virus. virus uh -huh. That's the uh, 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 the travel, the tra the tourists uh -huh. and uh, medical. Mm -hmm. That are very very damages. Yeah, and that's why they try to have the the tourists. Mm -hmm. So you can travel around mm -hmm. inside the U.S. Mm -hmm. You can deduct about four thousand dollar for tax for each individual. Yeah, that's great because <laughs> I've been solicited by a lot of tra travel agency calling yeah. me to go to Vegas, uh -huh. go to Minnesota, go to different states for a travel. I hope Senate <laughs> going to pass that bill. Yeah, because they uh, they introduced that bill on uh, last few days, and I hope that Senate will debate and uh, vote for that. And it passed. So you get some money from your wallet, right? Yeah, and that's good to uh, motivate people to travel within the United States. Yeah, that's a yeah. good thing. And also on June, we got a positive news is the, the retail mm -hmm. increase. Mm -hmm. The sale, the retail store increase mm -hmm. sale. 
That's good. So that's a good for economy. Yes. Okay. Yes. Last month uh-huh. we have the, we reduced the uh, unemployment, mm-hmm. and this month mm-hmm. we have to uh, we got a good news here on the retail store mm-hmm. making good business right now. Yeah, it's very good. But mm-hmm. I just heard yesterday Gavin Newsom mm-hmm. is planning to shut all the business he's down warning, again. But he warning, not easy. Yeah, he's planning. That's he's plan- his plan. And yeah. you know what? He signed as executive, uh, executive order mm-hmm. for the vote by mail. Mm-hmm. That violation, the, that uh, violation, the constitution. Because yep. he cannot sign that. Yeah. He don't. He do not have any authorized to sign mm-hmm. that because that that they belong to the federal government. Yeah. And, federal and, and Congress. Yeah, but the thing is that he overstepped the assembly and the senate. Okay, that's a violation. Thing. Yeah, uh, and we understand there's super majority mm-hmm. in the Demo- uh, in the senate and the assembly floor in California. Mm-hmm. But he has to let follow through the process, let them vote it on mm-hmm. before he make any kind of law because uh-huh. he, it's like the president, right? The uh, the the Congress and Senate, mm-hmm. they vote and they pass law before yeah. they bring it to the president. Yes. Okay. And then the president signs Side. to law. Uh-huh. So the same thing concept for the each state. Yeah. They have to follow the process, but but Gavin Newsom just goes straight to yeah, him. Yeah. They they call it executive order. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He did that not, and he violation the constitution. Yeah. But the good thing. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Okay. So uh, I guess uh, right now. Um, the good thing is that uh, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo mm-hmm. uh, is putting pressure on the so on the news outlet. Okay, news outlet from China. China. Okay, China, I yeah. know them because they relate associate with the uh, Phoenix TV mm-hmm. and the Phoenix TV is pro uh, uh news media. They, uh, you know what, the headquarters in Hong Kong, mm-hmm. but they, you know what, they favor for the Chinese uh, government. Yeah, and they just, you know. Propaganda. Yeah, they're and, pushing their uh, and propaganda. The, and the tower mm-hmm. is in Mexico, in mm-hmm. Prosca to California, and uh, FCC stop them. Yeah. Give yeah. them 48 hours to stop it. That's last perfect. Week. And also, they also one thing, mm-hmm. because the FCC is going to note for them, mm-hmm. you know, for uh, media from uh, Chinese government, yeah. like uh, China Daily, uh, yeah. CCTV, and uh, Global TV, mm-hmm. and uh, Pupil Daily. Yeah. Four of them, they mm-hmm. not recognize the media anymore. Yeah. This is the propaganda from the Chinese government. Exactly. And they have to do the rule by the, the propaganda um, uh, department, mm-hmm. not the media. Exactly. U.S. not recognize them the media anymore. Yeah. So. And they, let me read those outlets again, okay? So the outlet that's questionable are the Chinese Central tel- Television, mm-hmm. the China News Services, mm-hmm. the People's Daily, and the Global Time. Mm-hmm. Those are illegal because they are CCP. Uh, yeah, that's why they said they cannot yeah. recognize them about yeah. the. Uh, um, they're not the media anymore. Mm-hmm. They're the propaganda uh, organizations from Chinese yeah. government. That's the. But, but Mike Pompeo announced, but mm-hmm. FCC uh-huh. doing that yeah. thing. And the, but, but Mike Pompeo wants transparency within them. Yep, because yeah. you know why? When you do the journalist, okay, mm-hmm. for example, I explain for you, okay, when you go to, uh, to China mm-hmm. to get the news, mm-hmm. and you write the news, oh, what happened in China, and you mm-hmm. report to US, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And China have to do the same, mm-hmm. but they're not. Exactly. They're coming here, and they write a good thing about China and they just spread in here. Mm-hmm. They're not getting new from US to get back in China. Yeah. But yeah. they just try to something that that's the propaganda. Yeah. It's and that's not, not the news. True journalists. Journalism yeah. has Journalist. been way bad. You yeah. Know, so wrong. You know, there are no true journalists anymore. It's rare. It's rare to find them. That's why they missed up because yeah. the journalist, when you okay, you were coming here, mm-hmm. you're working, right? Mm-hmm. You take the news here, you know the news here, and you report to China, okay, what happened in US? Mm-hmm. That's the journalist. Yeah, right? exactly. But they they been here, they're not doing that job. Mm-hmm. They're doing here, they just say something good about communists yeah. and they they spread on the uh, misinformation mm-hmm. and everything. And they try to manipulate our mm-hmm. society. Exactly. That's why we call them propaganda. They're yep. not a media. Yep, exactly. <clears throat> and not only that, they they don't bring back the, the right information as well. They mm-hmm. bring about their uh, their perspective. Okay? <laughs> Journalism is not about your perspective. Uh-huh. Okay? Yeah. It's about facts. Fact. And bring it back. But they not report. Yeah. They not report the fact here. Mm-hmm. They just report something from China to bring it here. That's yeah. propaganda. And also one more thing. Mm-hmm. I believe that uh, we have a problem on this election. When I heard John Kerry, yeah. the former uh, Department of Secretary, yeah. and he said that 
he going to make a revolution if Trump, get Trump win this election. Yeah. That's a threat. Yeah. It's not it's a, a one. It's a threat. It's a threat. Yeah. yeah, it's a threat because uh, if Trump win on that night mm -hmm. and Antifa, Black Lives Matter, they destroy our country again. Mm -hmm. But you know what? I know those uh, gun owners mm -hmm. throughout the 50 state, they're ready. Mm -hmm. Honestly, we are ready. If yeah. something happened on the uh, November 3rd election, November 4th uh, uh -huh, election, uh -huh. we are ready on yeah. hand. I think I think so, we have to prepare for that thing too. Exactly. Right? Don't let them, you know, whatever they want to do. Exactly. Okay? Yeah. And they try this, to do in that. Yeah, this is our country, guys. Mm -hmm. As you know, this is where you're going to raise your family. This is where you're going to do business. This is where your livelihood is. You have to fight for your freedom to be able to live out your life for you you and your family and your children's future you have to fight for it every generation fought for it i did okay? you know what yeah I, last couple of weeks uh -huh. did you see i did you see my uh am 15 yes oh, man. <laughs> yes yes you know like every if you think about it all conservative pretty much own guns okay yeah. because we understand that our second amendment right is so vital for protect ourselves and yep. our loved ones yeah and this time in history is so vital to be armed and be second amendment that's general. why i try to let the people know that okay on the on the november 3rd or mm -hmm. november 4th you have to prepare mm -hmm. you have to use your second amendment to protect your property your business because they're going to make some noise they're going to vandalize a lot of things mm -hmm. and they're going to destroy your city mm -hmm. even whatever they do the same what when a chocolate just uh, died last couple of days, couple mm -hmm. of weeks ago, right? Yeah. And they do it more. So this time we not let them do it. Exactly. Okay, we exactly. have to protect ourselves because they try to, you know, they try to do something real mm -hmm. and they try to overthrow mm -hmm. the, uh, the election result. Exactly. Okay, that's why and, we have and to. And you know what? They will cheat. Mm -hmm. So as conservative, we have to be on the lookout. What it means that we need to go out and vote. Yeah. Okay. And be proactive. Of course, go out and vote. I believe that our people are going mm -hmm. to do in that. But mm -hmm. be beside that, you have to protect for your family. Mm -hmm. Ready for everything. Yeah. Okay. Use your Second Amendment protect you and your family and your neighbor. Mm -hmm. Even your business too. Mm -hmm. On that day. Mm -hmm. On that night. Mm -hmm. On you that night to. and the day after the elections. Exactly. Because they're going to do something very, very, you know, dangerous. Mm -hmm. They destroy everything. You know, on that day, yeah. if my president mm -hmm. re-elect again, mm -hmm. you know what? The Trump administration is working hard to mm -hmm. to play this uh, uh, game right. Yeah, and not only that, he's having offense, mm -hmm. like a, an offense. Yeah. Okay, to make sure that there's no cheating, mm -hmm. because the Democrat we know they would cheat because they cannot win legally yes they cannot win legally that's why and they try to overthrow the reserve of the uh, election mm -hmm. they try to do in that mm -hmm. that's why we have to prepare it okay mm -hmm. we have to let the people know okay mm -hmm. be careful on that day uh, ready for that day yeah okay exactly. because the, whatever the reserve okay we have to protect because mm -hmm. i believe that democrat going to do mm -hmm. something weird yeah and you know what i know the conservative will be voting mm -hmm. but you know how we have our children, sometimes mm. they're adult, but they don't really come and vote. We have to make that effort to make sure they will vote, okay, for Trump. Mm. And not only that, but explain to your neighbors and friends why we're mm. voting for Trump. Yeah. Between uh, Joe Biden and Trump, who has the balls to fight against the CCP? Sleepy Joe. Come on. You know what I mean? <laughs> Joe Biden will be sleeping on the job, okay? Yeah. But Trump will have the backbone and the guts to he, go against He said a lot of bad things about Trump, but I western about I western him. <laughs> that, okay, in eight years you you were the vice president yeah, of the United States. What have he done? What you have to done for our country. Exactly. Nothing. 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 Okay. Not for the black community. Not for the <laughs> not for uh, Americans. Nothing. 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 Okay. And that's why now he tried to say he tried to attack Trump something. It's weird. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, you know, with that, on that note, uh, in Congress, I guess the Senate mm. uh, was trying to present a bill for to reform the police. Yeah, I know. But they Nancy block. Pelosi, they block it. Block and then she accused that the GOP is, uh, you know, is trying to... Uh, um, no, and the, one, the, the Senate blocked that bill is the Republican. 
and uh, by required from uh, uh, from the uh, White House. Well, it was the bill from Nancy Pelosi. She mm. has a certain day amount to get every all the resolutions That's presented. That's in, in the House. Okay? Yeah, but she but didn't have in anything. The Senate. Yeah, uh, in the in Senate. Senate. In the Senate, I believe that they are going to propose the reform the policy, mm -hmm. and I believe that and they have they have to. Uh, Amend something in there. Mm -hmm. Amendment something in yeah. there. Yeah, and, and uh, I think it's Tim Scott, right? Mm -hmm. Who presented and say, "Hey, the Democrats, don't you want the eighty percent of your bill to pass? Mm -hmm. And then if you win the presidential election, get the other twenty percent." Uh -huh. But they don't want the eighty percent because they don't want solution. They you don't know that, want, right? They, they don't want block. solution. They just want to block it. Yeah, because the things that if they have solution, mm -hmm. then there's no riots. There's no chaos. So they do not want solution, guys. Mm. The American people want solution, okay? We always want it. Yes. We always want it, yes. okay? The solution for everything. Yes. But they just try to block and that's it. Because they want to make noise, they want to make it hard for the election. That's yep. it. Yep, okay. they want chaos. Because, you know, there's some people who thrive on fighting. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing. The Democrat, like... I never on, see like, a Democrat fighting. working for our country. Exactly. They just for working for a politic only. Exactly. Not for, for our their country. re election. Yeah, that's yeah. right. And to secure their power. Mm -hmm. And yeah. good news, okay, uh, for the VFO, the people who are concerned about the South China Sea mm -hmm. on this week, mm -hmm. it's very good news. Uh, U.S. Navy and U.S. Marine and uh, Air Force increase in South China Sea to protect for our partner mm -hmm. and our allies there. Yeah. And we have three. Uh, uh, aircraft carrier there, mm -hmm. uh, uh, so-called uh, Theodore Roosevelt, uh -huh. uh, Neesmith, and uh, Ronald Reagan. Mm -hmm. They own in South China Sea now, yeah. and they try to protect our ally. Mm -hmm. That's very good. Inside that, we have uh, Japan, mm -hmm. South Korea, Taiwan, mm -hmm. especially mm -hmm. Taiwan, and also some of our partners in uh, South China Sea, like uh, Malaysia, Indonesia, mm -hmm. Singapore. Philippines, Singapore. Mm -hmm. Singapore okay. That's not, good. That's the yeah. good thing. And that the China not cannot do anything in South China Sea right now. Mm -hmm. They try to uh, increase the military uh, uh, martial, mm -hmm. but right now we have all monitor there. Mm -hmm. And that's a very good thing for the people who concern the South China Sea. Yeah. And the South China Sea is effective to our country right now. Exactly. And they, you know what? This morning, mm -hmm. I read the report from the uh, Christopher Ray, mm -hmm. the FBI director. Mm -hmm. He said the most dangerous for US right now is Chinese. Yeah. And he said in his hand right now, mm -hmm. 2000 case investigation relate with China. Yeah. Yeah, because the thing is that if the Chinese take over mm -hmm. for vi vi the Vietnam culture es and country, yeah, mm -hmm. we will not get the fishing, okay, right? Mm -hmm. We will not get the trade. We will not get anything. Mm -hmm. So Chinese are, uh, the CCP is very dangerous. Yeah, and then he yeah. wanted that, you know, what? in this time, mm -hmm. the China tried to do is spy everywhere. Oh, yeah. Okay, in yeah. our research, yeah. in our university, mm -hmm. yeah, in our aviation, mm -hmm. In they're our hacking healthcare. too. They're, they're hacking. hacking. The hacker mm -hmm. in China, they're yeah. hacking. But in here, mm -hmm. they're spying here too. Yeah, exactly. They're spying here too. And right now, is the they most, you know, the country most, you know, threatened to our security, mm -hmm. national security. And uh, um, they very dangerous right now is China, not Russia. Yeah. China. China is, China is yeah. the number one. Exactly. Not Russia. Exactly. Years long in Russia, right now is China. Yeah, exactly. So. Mike we Pompeo and Trump is keeping an eye on them, and Mike Pompeo, uh, Mike Pence as well. And, and Trump, they understand. You know, I remember Trump. That, you know, he Clear got two times. Mm -hmm. He 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 mentioned that we can cut completely ties with China. Yeah, yeah, because they cost us more money. Yeah, that's it why. More money. Two times he already you know mentioned that, mm -hmm. and I believe that Trump have a strategy mm -hmm. with China. Yeah, and we have to push hard with China. Yeah, and maybe we have. Mm -hmm. The military conflict with China mm -hmm. in South China Sea. Yeah, exactly. So that happened. I don't know when it happened, but mm -hmm. it's happened right now mm -hmm. and very hot over there. Yeah. And this is what I want to encourage our audience, conservative mm -hmm. audience, is that Trump is working so hard to fight for us American and our value here and our freedom. We have to fight and back him up. So stay, um, you know, in tune, stay alert, stay informed. Mm -hmm. So that way you can take action when time comes. But we have to back our president because the Democrats doing everything they can they to can. destroy him. You know him. what? 
they associate with on the left tick and around the world try to attack Trump, yeah. try to tear them down. And you know what? On the Europe, mm -hmm. they said, you said, I have a friend. Mm -hmm. He stopped by Europe uh, uh, last week mm -hmm. uh, because he's stuck in there. He cannot go back in here. Okay. And he said, hey, phone. He called me. Uh -huh. He said, hey, phone, do you know what? I go around the Europe on CNN. <laughs> you didn't, you didn't yeah. see Fox News there. Wow. See, that's why, you know what, they try to spread the fake news mm -hmm. about them and they, uh, they you know, they, they try to, you know, provoke the mm -hmm. people there mm -hmm. to anti Trump here. Yeah. They use the, the death of Chuck Floyd mm -hmm. and they protect all around the Europe. Mm -hmm. And they yeah. say, oh, we fight for racism, we fight for racism, but yeah. Chuck Floyd not racism. Yeah. See, the thing is that CNN, all the Democrat media, uh -huh. is tied into with the CCP. You know that, right? They tie with them yeah. and they tie with the left, with the uh -huh. radical left, too, exactly. in, in Europe. Yeah, And exactly. then that, they try to create a problem and they try to influence our politics here. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And that's, we have to fight against that. That's yes, unacceptable. Yes, that's why this is the land we live, not yeah. them. Exactly. Whatever they do outside you at doesn't matter with us. Yeah. Right? Exactly. We have to protect but our land here. But they want to infiltrate to control us. Oh, yeah. they control us 20 yeah. years already. Yes, I See, know. Every time we deal with Europe, mm -hmm. we got a problem. Yeah. We only got a problem when we deal with the uh, EU, mm -hmm. when we deal with China. Mm -hmm. We only got a problem yeah. 20 years already. Yeah. That's why Trump got out of the Trump UN. tried to get it back. Trump tried to get out of the, uh, the circle. Circle, yeah. That's, Trump to get want to get out of that circle. Mm -hmm. He want to make a, a new chapter for American people. Yeah, exactly. And then that's why they lost the benefit, and they try to attack Trump from outside, mm -hmm. from Europe to China. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. This week, actually, there was a hacking uh, that hack on secret uh, leaking out U.S. Uh, enforcement document. So See? I mean. I, I believe that the Congress and Senate have to have some bill to restrict this. Yeah, They're they have the bill, fight. but you know yeah. what? They always play the politics, I don't want it. Because yeah. you know what? They got a bill, so what? And they, they are have on to something, take action. they are on something, yeah. and then they do nothing. Yeah, exactly. They have to take action. And yeah. you know, if you think about it, it's Trump and I say maybe two or three other conservative mm -hmm politician who actually do something mm -hmm. and work hard for the American people. Mm -hmm. But let alone, I just see that every elected official from local, state level, and federal, they're all for themselves. Mm -hmm. They don't do the job like how Trump is. Okay? Trump work hard for the American. He, they fight hard. And they actually, he actually gets the job now, done. Even our local right here. Yeah. Okay? You know, Michelle They're just Steele. playing with politics. You, you know what? Michelle Steele. Uh-huh. She run for the... the the 48 uh, yeah, district, congressional right? district, her, Congress, right? uh -huh. uh, her people, uh -huh. some of her friends or something, uh -huh. contact me yesterday. Uh -huh. And I just require one thing. Mm -hmm. If you want me to support you, mm -hmm. if you want me to uh, help you, I just need your letter officially on your position right now, mm -hmm. the county supervisor mm -hmm. endorse President Trump. Mm -hmm. She denied. She would not endorse President Trump. She's not right. She said, wow. no, no, no. She denied, but she's not, not, not denied. Exactly. She mm -hmm. said, oh, her staff said, oh, uh, we cannot proceed that letter on this harm. So it's when politic. you want, when, when you want, when you want to proceed that letter. You know, the sad thing is that I noticed a lot of uh, uh, politicians or and those who are husband, running. And okay. her husband. Yeah, it's he the, the, the center of, you know what, the committee center of the Republican. Yeah, he is the he national should, committee. Yeah. Yeah. He should do it. This is the it. thing. This is the thing. I'm very pissed. Uh -huh. Okay, I'm very pissed at the GOP. A lot of them are rhinos. California GOP. Yeah, California GOP. A lot of them are rhinos and establishment. They do not support our president, and I'm sick and tired of it. Yeah. You know, uh, until you have the balls mm -hmm. to play and, and be in the upfront and mm -hmm. protect defend your president then get out of get get away get out of the field okay they just deal uh, you know what and compromise with the democrat yeah because there's a saying mm -hmm. i don't know if you know but growing up my parents all say do not play make mm. deal with the devil yes okay that's why because at the end of the day they compromise you will lose you will lose you will lose so those uh gop uh those Republican candidates uh -huh. who are establishment rhino uh -huh. and have no backbone, you think you're playing with the devil right now and think you have all that benefit and, uh, and you get have, a vote from yeah, them. Yeah, vote. But and at the lose. end of the day, by the end, 
You will lose. Yeah, you will lose sure. everything. But not only that, yeah. they will blackmail your family, your children, and you because you you have family, right? They're gonna blackmail you to do what they do, and then at the end, you might lose your life if you're with Hillary more, Clinton. More than you got. Yeah. Good more than you got. Exactly. So it's not worth it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right now, if you're making deals with the Democrats and you're elected mm -hmm. official, you come straight up with your children but and your wife or spouse uh -huh. and tell them this is what I'm doing uh -huh. and I want to change that. I'm going to change my course and do the right thing for the people. But I believe that on my channel, the listener and the audience, mm -hmm. they go not going to vote for the people who not loyalty with the, uh, the, the party and yeah. also, you know Who what? are not true and, supporters. Yeah. If you're not writing that letter and endorse our president, you got you're not going you to lost, get uh, yeah. any voter for my channel exactly sure. and not only that you lo lose money and support yeah. and votes period uh -huh. that's it that's yeah. why i said see they try to you know uh -huh. the politics they try uh -huh. to compromise uh -huh. and then you know that's why you said deal with the devil mm -hmm. devil it doesn't work at and the then end. Go, in the end of the day you you lose everything you lose, you lose everything. more than you got yeah okay that's yeah. the way okay did Anything you else? did you hear about uh young kim Young Kim. Uh -huh. Okay, so, so on Twitter, she posts about uh, how um, she said Trump was being racist of saying, you know, all the kung fu. Uh, kung fu. Yes. So kung fu. When yeah, kung fu. When, 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 he, when he said that yeah. in a tune star. Uh huh. Uh huh. Exactly. So Young Kim kind of. Uh, Vincent Ching. Yeah, so Young Kim lashed out at Trump uh -huh. saying that he was, you know, wrong for doing that and he's being racist. Uh -huh. And a lot of the supporters said, hey, with Republican like you, Young Kim, who needs a Democrat? Uh -huh. <laughs> like they say, hey, I vote for you in 2018. I will not vote for you again. Uh -huh. You know, it's like now we see the true color of those who are, say they're Republican, but they're not. OK, so they're, they're being exposed. So you guys are wise enough, uh, do the research, see who you're going to support, who actually value the true conservative values. Because if you don't, they're rhinos. They come in there and they sit in the Congress. You know what they'll do? Nothing for us. Nothing for the president. That's Nothing. why on this show, I just let the only candidate in California, the mm -hmm. Republican candidate, mm -hmm. you better watch out. Because my channel, I, I have a lot of voters here. They're not going to vote for you if you not uh, support our president right now. Yeah, and you know what? Our voice is very loud, and we have a loyal, trusted community yeah. that value what we say. Mm -hmm. And so they will, they will do what we tell them. Mm -hmm. You know, if this candidate is not for Trump, we'll, we'll call you out. We are so sick and tired of you mm -hmm. doing, like, pedaling, flip-flop back and forth. This is not the time for you to flip flop. This is the time for you to have a backbone. Uh -huh. If you're running for either uh, local politics, uh -huh. state level, or federal, you better stand up with a backbone. This because coming you know election. what? When they, if even they got there, yeah, they win in the election. Mm -hmm. They not do anything to support our president and our exactly. policy. That's why why we vote for them. Yeah, it's gonna be pointless. Yeah. So this why, why I vote for you if you not support our, our president and our policy, mm -hmm. you know. Exactly. Now, this is the plan. Oh. In 2022, uh -huh. I'm raising up leaders uh -huh. to run for local, federal, and state level. Mm -hmm. Okay? If any of you guys are interested, I am a delegate for the California GOP uh -huh. and also a delegate for uh, our Orange County. Yep. Uh, so, if you want to run... Mm -hmm. Message me, call me, contact me on my social media, Facebook yeah. or on this channel. I'll respond back to how to get a hold of me, yeah. and uh, and Fun will put it up as well. Yeah. And so in that way, we can train you for 2020. Okay, that's what we need right now. We need good candidate, conservative that really care for the people. Okay, in this that's country. It. Okay, well, I want to encourage everyone with the last message. Okay, okay. encouragement. I want to say this. Um, let me pull up my notes here so okay. i want to say don't be afraid of change because it is leading you to a new beginning that's joyce meyer mm -hmm. so just remember change is good mm -hmm. it grows us so mm -hmm. embrace it okay guys god bless <laughs> you and god bless the usa see you next week yes